Hello to you all, hello to you and yours. My name is Andile Daisy, and I do everything, guys. I'm a 23 year old. Then I don't get shame. I cannot wait to unfold it to you guys. And welcome to my world. Welcome to my channel. I hope you stay. I hope you subscribe. I hope you interact. And I hope you criticize. So in today's video, ne, I did not necessarily felt like doing this, given the fact that each and every channel starts with getting to know me, getting to know, and not that I'm comparing or anything, but I, my, I for one wanted to come with something like, I wanted to get straight into the content, but gang, I went on Twitter and I asked people to subscribe to my channel. People were like, no, yes, we can see your intro and it's dope and it's killer, but how's your personality? Hence, gang, we are getting on personal levels. We are getting on personal levels. So today's video is a question and answer. And these are questions from my social media platforms and that's Facebook and Instagram. So let us get into it. What inspired the idea to start a YouTube channel? My personality, guys. I have a very, like... People appreciate my presence. Those who love me whenever I enter a room. I'm very talkative, first of all. And 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 who I have a sense of style which is very which is very suitable for my channel. And I don't know guys, I think it's just seeing your favorite YouTubers doing what you are doing that on bar. There is no way I and I love to cement myself in things. Never mind the eye back, guys. I had a long day. I just had to make up myself to look like to look the part. Second question is what can we expect from your channel? I don't want to go into specifics, but I would love to say everything for those who don't follow me on instagram i do fitness i do beauty i do wellness i do talks hey i i do talks love i do talks so i'm a very versatile person expect me to tap into things expect me to switch things up because okay, it's not something that's gonna have you guys like mm, but okay it goes up i'm 90 guys as the 90 in whichever way you feel like conceiving demand demand guys so obviously so expect fun expect fun from the channel and the third question is what's your longest relationship let's count <laughs> mm. yeah my longest relationship is seven years. Yeah, it's seven years. Hmm, is it seven years? Eh, wait, wait, we knew each other for two years, but I'm gone by two years. Yeah, but but uh, yeah, my longest relationship is. Can I get guys to come to a relationship? Because as I'm in relationships in Atlanta, man, it has that thing of lasting. It has that lasting effect, like Jenge. Like my other relationship is three years. The other one is like I call relationship. I've never dated six months. Hence, I'd never find myself into things like e casual teasing or bagaloko. Guys, the awkward man into is casual and into is temporary. Okay, oh let's keep it between us and stuff. Yes, we are young, but gang kum nandi kale into is into In fact, my ikamalamblums should be no cementa because I cement myself, guy. I cement myself into relationships in the Let us pause it there. So the next question is Do you inherit beef? It depends, Mdagabao. To me, it depends on the root of all evil like what did you do to my sister what did you do to my cousin what 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 did you do to my kid and hence and on bar if it's that deep 
my city you guys shared a boyfriend and i found myself talking to you and come she would mind because get a boyfriend zindes ngane manintes fana ne boyfriend so oftentimes i don't it depends on the depth of the situation hence i'm saying oftentimes i do guess anna because you don't do people dirty and expect me to smile with you and uh, yeah next question why is your surname so funny what are you and where are you from i'm very much closer standards I'm, i am closer and i'm from uppington uh there's like a lot of african surnames attached to native people like attached to black people next question hi mazet please help us out the ajelo and the early advice let me pick my glass up for this one i have a glass cap the girl in the guy of this life ne? because i'm i'm giving advice as to that aspect ne? we are jela and surely you won't say we are jela if you guys were not in a relationship relationship my advice to you is ndazekaya au no hamba ah ewe a feminist Feminist YouTube is gonna come to my com comment section and attack me because I'm saying I'll know Amber. I'll know Amber, that's the guy. I'll know Amber because first of all, surely it's someone who has the memo. I feel like oftentimes some some girls have the memo when it comes to the guy and when it comes to the girl in the guy's life. And Ngoku, some girls enter such predicaments like some girls enter some some lump love triangles um do i enter rishe sana abe within knowing that you are there expecting you and that's the problem i have and hence i'm saying expecting you to 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 back off i'm the sick guy you see this chair sit on it and then you do like you do like this and then ewe to you can't don't don't disappoint me don't don't disappoint me stand us up you you are not going anywhere you are not going anywhere not sana i don't care who says what anyway should it be that your guy okay realistically speaking should it be like should it be that your guy is a serial cheater yeah let me put it that way should it be that your guy is a serial cheater I get I can't know yenza but gengoku if we are first born like if if it just came out of the womb and it said it is an jello hangai to bazana sit 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 may the best gel win may the best win and therefore your son you 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 I uh, you can't back down you 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 can't I love this topic Yeah, Bella, son, it needs a refill. Next question. What is your deal breaker when it comes to relationships? I believe my deal breaker would be someone who's someone who can't force. Guys, Nadia, I love to be I love to be forced in a relationship. And I Guys, they are trying to think when I tap into unrealistic thoughts of the not that I constantly tap into that, but guys, uh, you get those girls whom do you, you love to be forced when it comes to relationship things and you just want to you just want your boyfriend to be like that. Tell him to. Him. Oh, Trinity. You just want your boyfriend to be like that. Tell him to. Him. <sighs> Uteni such things this is big to me it's big to me love so my deal breaker would be umdu ozauti when i break up with him 
especially oh, okay obviously i said that it's gonna be on temporary basis my deal breaker would be can city kumdu it's over atilamdu okay yeah okay Jan, Jan, how do you say okay when when I expect you to be like no, don't give up on us. Umdu, my deal breaker would be someone someone who's not eager to fight for the relationship and someone who you must force him yet the energy must not represent re <laughs> the energy must not reciprocate. Yes, I I love reciprocal things. I love them. I love them therefore um to funeke funeke um to unthank funeke um to un you must marinate me you must nurture my feelings next question is yes Anna Lenwati what are the aspects that you look into when it comes to relationship eh all these questions revolve around Sorry, revolve around relationships. But okay, yeah, it's fine. The aspects that I look into. Guys, I cannot date a, a lazy person. I'm so sorry. I can't date a, a lazy person because first of all, realistically speaking, I push myself. Shame. I when push comes to shove, I push myself. And the only way I get to get things done is by pushing myself. And oftentimes you need that partner that's going to be like, I get this done. And oftentimes you need to be inspired by your effort, the efforts of your partner. Yes. Mm -mm. You need to be inspired. And yeah, oh guys, when you don't do anything with your life, and how do you expect things to work? How, ah, uh, ah, uh, now guys, relationships can either build you or drag you down. And my biggest fear is being in a relationship that's going to drag you. Uh, uh, mm -mm. So don't be a lazy partner. Have a plan. Have a plan. Don't be a lazy partner. And get on a class theater. The conversation will flow. Love, what do you want to do in the next London year? And now I can contribute. You see? Again, reciprocal, stand or stand, reciprocal. And so we have come to an end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the Q&A and I hope you guys are going to subscribe to my channel for those who have not yet subscribed. Thank you guys so much for watching up until this point and until next week.